welcome to your CBS On The Go forecast. I'm meteorologist Lisa Meadows, breaking down what you can expect in the weather world coming up here tomorrow. Temperature-wise, it's going to be warm. Temps topping out in the lower 80s for the Valley and Delta. Lower 60s for the Bay Area. Partly cloudy skies, a little bit of fog to start off there. For the rest of us, though, plenty of sunshine. Temperature topping out at 66 for the Sierra. Seven-day forecast, low temps in the 50s. High temps in the 80s, mid-80s as we head into Tuesday. Dropping down for Wednesday, but a big rebound as we head on into the weekend. Dry with sunshine, even a 90-degree temp on on Saturday. That's your CBS On The Go forecast. Lisa, thanks, and welcome to your On The Go News Report. I'm Sharon Rege. Placer County officials are helping residents conserve water this summer with three days of mulch mayhem. It started Saturday morning at Sierra College, where each visitor could pick up one free yard of mulch. Officials say mulch slows down evaporation, regulates soil temperature, and adds helpful nutrients as it breaks down. Two more events are set for May 12th and the 19th. Local businesses came together to create a buzz around California bees and their honey. The second annual California Honey Festival took place in downtown Woodland Saturday. Restaurants and bars offered creative honey-themed food items and drinks. Attendees also had a chance to learn about issues that confront honeybees like pesticide use and diseases. There's kids' activities where they get to do uh, planting and turn, learn about pollinator-friendly plants. They actually take a path of a bumblebee so they learn how they bounce into different flowers. The Honey Festival benefits bee and pollinator nonprofit organizations doing research and education on bee health worldwide. Sacramento collectors and cosplayers started gathering at Empire's Comics Vault for the Free Comic Book Day Festival. Guests can watch Supreme Pro Wrestling and participate in charity raffles for Shriners Hospitals with up to 20,000 comic books available for no cost. All are welcome to attend the event that goes until 8 Saturday night. For more local stories and the latest on developing stories, just visit our website, cbs13.com. Thanks for watching. Safe travels. Have a beautiful day.